My name is Anastasia Tiller and I'm an artist based in Lethbridge on Bonavista Peninsula. I am greeting you today from my studio because we are social distancing and uh, but I'm very glad and happy to share my space with you today. I'm very excited about the upcoming exhibition at the Crafts Council Gallery titled Room for Happiness and I would like to thank the team of Crafts Council of Newfoundland and Labrador uh, and Bruno Venus in particular for keeping in touch during this strange times and for his support, advice and help in installation uh, of the show. Room for Happiness, or since the end of 2020, Welcome to My Bubble, is a series of hand-hooked drugs depicting mystical creatures, stylized portraits, moving soft sculptures and paintings. My creations help me express myself and communicate ideas about imagination and fantasy as coping mechanism, as a method, and art making as an expansion of time and space. So whether we are confined uh, within a room, like a bubble, we can always look inside and using imagination, fantasy, find infinity and freedom of expression. The majority of my work for this exhibition was produced during the 2020 and 2021 ongoing pandemic. Working on the series has been a way to escape, to cope with the uncertain world around us and uh, sort of travel into my own personal world or a personal bubble to overcome an emotional trauma associated with fear, loneliness and travel deprivation during the pandemic. Art making helps to create a sense of purpose and establish a productive routine. I believe that creating art and interacting with art can expand spaces we exist in, especially during forced isolation. Feeling happy is a very important emotion uh, in the area of diverse and no less important experiences of the human psyche. To maintain our well-being, we need to practice curiosity and wonder. Playing with shapes and bright colors is thrilling and helps to raise serotonin levels. I enjoy looking at vividly dyed yarn and the warmth that rugs produce. I feel an exchange of energy with the material I'm working with. What I appreciate the most about fiber art and rug hooking is that it gives us not only visual but tactile perception, which is intrinsic to rug hooking. Interacting with fiber art uh, teleports us to the rudimentary way of discovering the world, which is through touch. But even just by looking and not touching the rug, you still have that, you know, sort of feeling <laughs> tingling uh, in your fingertips because you know the texture is exciting. Um, so uh, for me, happiness depends, of course, on ourselves. So to me, it is an intentional action and therefore a journey. In my body of work, Room for Happiness, I present humor and imperfection as my journey of making art. And I really hope that uh, this resonates with the audience and I'm very excited that in this technological age we can share this exhibition not only with uh, St. John's audience but with West Coast, Labrador, with Canada in general and the entire you know really planet where people have internet they can access uh, our uh, YouTube videos and uh, so this is very exciting. And yes, the subject of uh, happiness kind of intrigued philosophers since Aristotle and uh, to Leibniz and Voltaire. And I sort of side with uh, uh, Leibniz, the philosopher, saying that we live in the best possible world. So I'm trying to, uh, you know, be optimistic. And I think we need um, a lot of it right now. Uh, so I'm very happy to share my work with you and uh, hopefully you will um, follow uh, my journey uh, maybe through social media and uh, uh, with the uh, Crafts Council 
Newfoundland and Labrador, I would like you to uh, follow the updates on the website so to see when uh, we will be able to uh, experience art and fine craft in person because this is the best way to experience it and in the meantime we will see each other online thanks so much have a great day and uh, enjoy art and make art bye